Over 33 million visitors fly into and out of Newark Airport every year. A great number of them are heading to the Big Apple. And though many of them are here long enough only to fetch their luggage or transfer flights, tourists can't help but notice the sights, the sounds, and sometimes even the smells along this 17-mile stretch of the New Jersey Turnpike between the airport and Manhattan. Unfortunately, this is the first and most lasting impression these visitors have of the Garden State. What's worse is that they tell their friends, and over the years, New Jersey has gotten a bad reputation. Even our neighbors judge us from across the Hudson. The driving seems to be a little bit more aggressive. Major holdups, traffic, bumper to bumper, really bad traffic. All the way down the turnpike and across the Delaware. What I do not like about New Jersey is all the circles and the way if you take one at wrong exit, you get lost immediately. Pollution. Roads are bad. I hate it. <laughs> too hectic, way too hectic. Those of us from Jersey know better. We know that traveling the turnpike can lead to a series of crossroads to some of the most beautiful views in the country. Sure, there are plenty of pop culture references that make New Jersey unique. Jersey Shore. Jerseylicious. Guido. But for those of us who take the roads less traveled, we know it's the ocean, the mountains, and everything in between that hold the true Jersey charm. From High Point with its tranquil vistas to Cape May with its serene shores and Victorian beauty. Countless roadside treasures can be found in every corner of the state in all directions. People don't realize how wonderful it's very varied. There's the uh, northwest corner, it's got uplands and skiing, and then there's the long Jersey Shore, there's quiet parts of the Jersey Shore, honky tonk parts of the Jersey Shore. It is an amazing place. Lots of green space. People take it for granted. Two wonderful cities on either side of it. You just need to tell people to come this way. If they saw South Jersey or if they saw the mountains in North Jersey, they would fall in love with it. The part they see is just a little sad. That's all. So the next time you find yourself on the New Jersey Turnpike, don't be in such a hurry to leave. Take it and connect to the places that make up the real sights and smells of New Jersey.